When it comes to helping UT students get free food, the UT Outpost has been a one-stop shop. This year, a lot more students are learning about UT Outpost and using the resource, which is great. Um, and that also means that food flies off our shelves and in particular, some of the food items that are very easy for students to cook and quick for them. Like cans of soup. That's why Food for Fines is asking for soup in order to pay off your citation. It's needed because the Outpost finds one third of UT students struggle to afford nutritious meals. This year, UT Outpost has already served over 2,000 students. Food insecurities is a real thing on our campus. How, as us as a department, how can we give back? How can we address that? The goal with Food for Fines, keeping more food on UT Outpost shelves. With such a large department as parking and transportation, um, I think this will greatly benefit our students visiting Outpost, and it has in the past. The cans of soup must be at least 10 ounces unopened and unexpired. If your fine is 15 to $35, then you only need five cans of soup in order to dismiss your citation. If your fine is 36 to $75, then you will need seven cans in order to waive your citation. In previous years, food items like peanut butter and pineapple were collected. It amounted to nearly $7,500 in waived citations. You can donate cans to any staffed parking garage on campus to clear your parking fines.